The Lord be with you. I'm Deacon Keith Fournier. And our first reading is taken from the book of the prophet Isaiah. The Lord says, I am coming to gather every nation and every language. They will come to witness my glory. I shall give them a sign and send some of their survivors to the nations, to Tarshish, Put, Lud, Meshach, Tubal, and Javan, to the distant coasts and islands that have never heard of me or seen my glory. They will proclaim my glory to the nations, and from all the nations, they will bring all your brothers as an offering to Yahweh, on horses and chariots and litters, on mules and on camels, to my holy mountain, Jerusalem. Yahweh says, like Israelites bringing offerings and clean vessels to my house, and some of them I shall make into priests and Levites, Yahweh says. Our response is taken from Psalm 117. Alleluia, praise Yahweh all nations, extol him all peoples, for his faithful love is strong and his constancy never ending. And our second reading is from the letter to the Hebrews. Have you forgotten that encouraging text in which you are addressed as sons? My son, do not scorn correction from the Lord. Do not resent his training, for the Lord trains those he loves and chastises every son he accepts. Perseverance is part of your training. God is treating you as his sons. Has there ever been any son whose father did not train him? Of course, any discipline is at the time a matter for grief, not joy. But later in those who have undergone it, it bears fruit in peace and uprightness. So steady all weary hands and trembling knees and make your crooked paths straight. Then the injured limb will not be maimed. It will get better instead. A reading from the Holy Gospel, according to St. Luke. Through towns and villages he went teaching, making his way to Jerusalem. Someone said to him, Sir, will there be only a few saved? And he said to them, Try your hardest to enter by the narrow door, because I tell you, many will try to enter and will not succeed. Once the master of the house has got up and locked the door, you may find yourself standing outside, knocking on the door, saying, Lord, open to us. But he will answer, I do not know where you come from. Then you will start saying, we once ate and drank in your company. You taught in our streets. But he will reply, I do not know where you come from. Away from me, all evildoers. Then there will be weeping and grinding of teeth. When you see Abraham and Isaac and Jacob and all the prophets in the kingdom of God and you yourselves thrown out. And people from east and west, from north and south, will come and sit down at the feast in the kingdom of God. Look, there are those now last who will be first, and those now first who will be last. The Gospel of the Lord.